I think I've learned a lot being that I can now use Final Cut, I know how to mute clips, I know how to stretch them out, I know how to uh, continually edit kind of with the continuity and things like that. Um, the the location I thought for our preliminary was thought about very well. Um, we kind of tried to create quite a shifty character in Lucy Finn later and um, for Anna to be quite an innocent character. So I thought the location we picked was quite, the kind of panorama of the area in the background I thought was quite, um, I thought, I don't know, it was quite, it brought kind of different aspects to the film rather than it just being a straight conversation. Um, I mean the shots we were able to get of Lucy on the ceiling were, on the roof rather, were really good being that she could look so impatient and be able to look out over the thing to show, over the kind of area to show her emotion. Um, the process of running a shoot, um, the the process of actually running our our actual filmmaking, uh, we found I found personally I found quite difficult, being that it was a Sunday and it was my only day off because I work on Saturdays. I found you know getting it done. I wanted to get it done so I could get home, um, which was quite difficult because we the actors uh, Lucy and Perry are very good friends, so it was quite difficult to kind of keep them on task and um, I think me and Anna both struggled quite a lot with that. Um, the, how much to shoot I think we definitely underestimated. Um, I We managed to do it in something like three hours and I thought we'd covered every aspect but when, when it came to editing, kind of the nearer end of editing we realised we hadn't. Um, achieving a seamless narrative I think we did very well being that we had under the amount of shooting I thought that we probably did need. Um, it wasn't perfectly seamless but it was as good as we could get and being that we didn't actually know how bad it kind of looked till quite near the end we managed to clear everything up I thought pretty well. Um, using a timeline, stuff like that, I, I took to quite easily. It was more kind of just getting it, the editing just right and working out where to cut and stop things and put them back together again. Um, the evaluation process, I've, um, I'm finding it quite difficult. This is kind of the first section of it I'm doing, but I'm finding it quite difficult kind of choosing what to do, the best way to get my points across, um, because I feel some of it could be too improper and I feel some of it might be too formal, because I find the blog quite an informal way of doing things, so yeah. Working as a team, um, I've really enjoyed it. I came to Coombe as a completely new student and I don't think I could have got a better team. Um, they're very, very, they've, they've both got very good ideas. I mean, Lucy came up with the idea of having a different era altogether. Even though we disagreed with the era she chose to start off with, we both, we all eventually decided on the 80s and we all completely, we were completely happy with that. Um, even though I don't appear in the actual film, uh, because I didn't want to really, um, I felt that the input I gave in the filming and giving my opinion on the way the characters were, um, I thought the way Mandy was created, I had a great deal of input on kind of the way she acted and things like that. And I thought I created a very interesting character in her. Um, because often characters I find through reading and watching films, the characters who put on the biggest fronts are the ones with the most to hide. And I thought Mandy gave us a lot that she could be hiding, um, kind of in her big bravado. And the same, the same with Ted. Um, so I found great. I had great fun creating them, those two characters, as well as the stalker. The stalker was probably the most interesting to create um, because she was the most explorable. Kind of the way she was, how we got her to stalk the characters. Um, so I probably had the most fun creating the stalker, but getting the most personality into Mandy and Ted was also a, an amazing experience. I found. Um, it's improved my people skills, things like that, simple things like that. Uh, my patience has got a lot better. Um, but yeah, I'm really, I'm really happy with the team I was put in and I don't think I could have been put in a better one.